So something a number of people seem unsure about is how to do anachronistic matchups in the Field of Glory. Uh, it's pretty simple, but I'll just show how to do it here. So let's say you want to do uh, early medieval Welsh against, say, the Babylonians. Well, clearly it's not initially an option. You have various armies from Northwest Europe in the 10th century, etc. You could turn off date filter. That means you have everyone available from the region. You turn off geographical. And there you go, your Babylonians. Next up, the time warp feature. So you can't just turn off the filters. You first have to select another module, go time warp, you launch. Right, and then once you've done that, you know, pick your army, ancient British against turn off the filters and yeah ancient british against i don't know vikings why not now you can match a medieval army against any ancient army you cannot do an ancients versus ancients because slithering likes to make money off of their games and not give them away for free uh yeah now one thing that's important to keep in mind with these totally silly matchups is that the game's units and army lists are not balanced to be a realistic comparison of this sort of thing. The unit equipment and quality statistics are based on their performance against contemporary opponents. So, you know, a 3rd century BC Seleucid cataphract unit would be fully armored. A 15th century unit of men at arms would probably be fully armored. One of those units is wearing mail or scale, and one is using hardened steel to protect against bullets and crossbow bolts. The game is not meant to simulate what would happen if these two fought, I and mean, they are both considered fully armored for the purposes of the system because they're balanced against contemporary opponents. So, this sort of thing is super entertaining, but you know, don't take it too seriously.